Welcome uh, Richard Lavery and uh, Tom Cherry to Poppy's TV. I've seen Richard uh, before a few times on the other side of the fence, <laughs> but uh, it, uh, it's nice to have you with us. Uh, good start to the season and uh, what a good result against uh, Kings Lynn Town, one of the favourites, uh, well the bookies' favourites, would be behind us, I think. Yeah, I think they will. I think they were second favourites, obviously we were, we were the favourites, so yeah, it's a good yeah. result. It was a tough match, and how did you see it from, from your angle? No, it was a great start, obviously. Two penalties early doors is a great start for the club, isn't it? Um, we used to put on both away re really well, and you, you can not uh, ask for more, really, for the start. Yeah, Reese has caught, been a handful most of the season so far in pre-season as well when he's been in there. He was, was on Saturday against Hitchin Town, running at them, got the pace of Borg coming in as well. Going to give the defenders a, a lot of challenges, aren't they? Yeah, he's, uh, obviously he's, he's, he's quick, he plays for his strengths and he can, he, can, he can go past players and he does win a lot of penalties because he is sharp behind the box. How has it um, affected you not having a, a direct target man? Aaron being, we're not sure yet, are we, what happened with Aaron? Yeah, so. we'll find out in the next couple of days about Aaron, like, but... Um, We've done well without him. Obviously, two wins out of two, we can't complain. But we do need it. We do need a target up there. But in the, in the meantime, the players that have gone up there have done well, so we can't complain. How do you see it, Tom? You've only been in with us a little while, and uh, you, I think, came with the, was it the last pre-season friendly. Uh, Nuneaton was the first game I was yeah. there, so uh, no, it's been good. Um, I think all the lads have worked really hard in pre-season. It's shown for the first two games. So I think we look fit, strong. Um, you know, like Love said tonight, the start, you know, really helped us. So. Two penalties uh, and Whitey saving a penalty. Great save, wasn't it? Oh yeah, yeah, it was brilliant. Brilliant, yeah. yeah brilliant save. He's done really well. Obviously, he's guessed the right way, which helps. But he's done well to push it out wide as well, not back into the middle. So we've got um, Hales out in town on Saturday. Um, a team I know very little about. I don't know how if you know much more about him um, than I do. But uh, mm. it'll be a tough game. They won tonight, I think. So yeah. um, good mate of mine, your assistant manager Matty Clark. So do you know a bit about him? Yeah, I've, yeah, I've played against Matty all, and with Matty for years over the years. So it'd be nice to see him again. Like so. They've signed a few players, they've got Lee Hughes up front and Ebanks Blake up front, so they'll be a Are threat. You from Wolves? Yeah, 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 yeah. So they've got them two up front, so they'll be a, a threat for us. Um, I don't know how they got on tonight, did they? They, they were winning, I know that, but um, mm -hmm. it, uh, I'm not quite sure of the results at the moment, but uh, we shall find those out later. But uh, in saying that, um, it, the team seems to be, our team seems to be all bonded together. The defensive qualities have been excellent in both games. I mean, it's a freak goal that um, Kings Lynn got a great goal, and no doubt about it, but uh, disappointing in one respect, because we'd, up until that point, we'd really been in control of the game. Yeah, I did say at half-time, said 2-0 was a funny score. I said, whoever gets the next goal... If it's us, then it's game over. If it's them, then we push back, and it did happen. But we've defended well for 20, 25 minutes, and obviously not conceded the second goal. So, all, all due respect to the, the defence, they were really good tonight. Fans, uh, 800 odd here tonight. Uh, not bad for uh, this um, time of the season. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, they, they they're like a third team, aren't they? they? They are good, and it does help you playing in front of a crowd. It does spur you on. So, yeah, that's it's brilliant. Yeah. So you're quite happy since you've been here. Yeah, yeah, I've been here all pre-season. Obviously, I've known Marcus for years. Um, your family pre-season is about coming in, so after I've come on board and yeah, I'm enjoying it. Well, only because we're winning. If we're winning I'm obviously <laughs> quite I'm vocal on the Lions, I must confess. Well, you know me as a player, so obviously <laughs> I, I don't really change, to be honest, but uh, I do get a bit carried away, but that's me as a person. So. Better to have enthusiasm, isn't it, really? That's and right. uh, talk about chalk and cheese. Thing, <laughs> that's right, yeah. So. I let Marcus sit down and I'll do all the shouting, so yeah, good. Okay, thank you very much, Tom and uh, best of luck on Saturday against um, Hellsway. Glad to have you here, Tom, yeah. and uh, we'll see you again. Okay, Top nice. Cheers. Nice to meet you. Take care.